Hi guys, a couple Legos here. And I'm here with another Bionicle mock. Um, this one is called the Protodermis Bear. And it is a Rahi. Obviously. Or not obviously, if you don't know Bionicle too well. Um, yeah. So, inspiration from this guy came from, um, from, uh, looking at this headpiece right here, and the Nuva chest plate, and just putting them together and thinking, wow, that'd be a really cool head, and, yeah, and I put those together and kind of built off of it from there. Yeah. So, let's get into the features, um... He has a butt, a butt, 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 a butt, a butt. Yep, he has a butt and a little tail, just like bears do. They have small tails. If you didn't know that, or you haven't seen a bear in your life before. So, um, yeah, he has a um, opening and closing jaw. Womp, womp. Womp. And he has a tongue. So magical. I feel like I'm more animated than other reviews. I'm just kind of excited about this creation. This is one of my favorites. Um, yeah. So, his... If you notice, his front two legs um are different from each other. This one is thin and slender. While the other one and oh I didn't expect that to happen. Um while the other one is big, bulky, and chunky and spiky. Yeah. So he's kinda of the the story behind these front two are kind of, it's kind of, um, the protodermis bear has kind of evolved to be this way in the Bionicle universe. So this, this appendage is used for crushing stuff, like squishing Rahi, I guess. It's a predator. You know, he squishes, he can crush stuff with this big blunt claw. It's very muscular and spiky. It's a crusher, it's a crusher claw, like a lobster. Well, another one, this one is meant for tearing and shredding apart his prey. Yep, that is not gruesome at all. Um, yep, he has, you can tell that this one's just sl slender because he doesn't need all the bulk and muscle to crush stuff. Um, and... Instead of having a big blunt claw, he has a claw with three finger-like slender and sharp talons, claws, whatever. And these are used, yeah, as I said before, they're used for slicing his prey. And, or her, not gender specified here. Um, yeah. So, let's get down to the articulation. Ball jointed legs, no knee. Not that they, I mean, they do have knees. Um, but I couldn't really incorporate that in there. Um, a ball jointed ankle on either leg. Then on the front two, um, ball jointed wrist. Elbow can go up and down. And ball jointed shoulder like most bion bionicles have and same thing with the other arm and the head as I've shown you before has can open up can open it and close its jaw I cannot speak today and it its upper jaw can also open and close and they're both on ball joints so this allows for a wide range of emotion you can sh like he can be posed he's like what I'm confused I'm very confused this one he could be like I'm gonna eat you 
And then this can be angry. He can be angry like this. Like he's about to kind of charge at you. He's like, I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to eat you. No. Okay. Yeah, that was a little strange. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this review. So, I can get him to stand up properly. There we go. I'll see you guys next time. And I hope you enjoyed. Bye.